Ciao, buongiorno ragazzi. I uh, hope you're having a wonderful day today. Anthony here for Inter Worldwide, bringing to you some more news. And the news is a departure today. And something that needs a little bit of reflecting on. Ivan Perisic has departed the club on loan for Bayern Monaco. And, you know, he's been photographed in Munchen doing his medical this morning. Um, so... This is someone who said that he's wanted to leave Inter for borderline two seasons now. He always said he wanted to play in the Prem. And, you know, it's, it's a representation of Conte and Marotta's hand. Because when you analyse Inter's squad over the last few years, Ivan Perisic is one of maybe two or three genuine world-class players. His athleticism on the wing has been nothing short of fantastic. His contribution based on assists and goals, you know, up until about... The starting point of last season was emphatical and he was definitely a crowd favorite up until the whole dressing room drama started uh, there's a lot of fans that will have mixed feelings about this but i for one am kind of happy about midway through last season i started just getting sick of ivan's inconsistencies and how sometimes he could put in a 10 out of 10 performance but that started to happen maybe once every seven or eight games last season uh, you could genuinely bank on him to have a poor game, a 6 out of 10 or a 6.5 out of 10, but still bank in an assist, cutting in on that left-hand side or, you know, doing his double crossover for the defender, taking it to the wide left foot and crossing it in for Icardi. But as we all saw last season with Inter, the dressing room deteriorated, the relationship deteriorated and the on-pitch performances suffered. And we are going with the trend of we back Conte and Marotta every step of the way. They got the Lukaku deal finalised. They made sure that we weren't going into the season completely screwed for attacking options. The Icardi situation is no longer 100% back against the wall for us. And Nainggolan, obviously with his personal issues, it was very sad. But you have Nainggolan, Perisic and Icardi, three players that presented us all sorts of difficulties last season off the pitch through their persona or, you know, just through their antics. And all three of those players are gone. And we're seeing a cohesive unit under Conte working together. So this is just the announcement that Perisic is gone. And, you know, I like him. I thank him for everything he's done. I'll continue to wear the jersey with his name on the back that I bought. But the timing was definitely right. And the only thing I'd be looking for now is to hope that Inter coop some sort of money for him. Whether it's an option, uh, sorry, an ob obligatory fee to buy around 20 mil, 25. Because at the end of the day, if he returns to us next season then his book value is going to be very, very low. But the thing is, keep an eye out for our Champions League register, our squad. I actually don't think we're going to register Ivan Perisic to our Champions League squad, only because if he does go on loan to Bayern, they may choose to redeem him in January um, if he's not cup-tied. But he'll, I'm not too sure about that either, to be honest. So anyway, we'll see what happens. Ciao.